In today's tech tip, I'll be showing you how to hide photos on your iPhone 16 and iPhone 16 Pro. So if you open up your gallery and there are a couple of photos you want to hide, all you have to do is select the photo or photos. So since I want to hide a couple, I'm just going to tap on select in the top right corner and then select for the photos I want to hide. Once I have them selected, I'll just tap on the three dot button in the bottom right corner and then select hide. And then confirm I want to hide four items. Alternatively, I can just open any photo and then tap on the three dot button in the top right corner and hide that individual photo. Okay. Now all hidden photos are going to be in a special hidden folder. So if you scroll down on the photos up until you go to the utility section, you should see hidden. Now the hidden folder is automatically uh, protected by face ID. So you do need to scan your face to be able to access the album. And once it opens, you can see all the photos you hid. Okay. Now that means only you have access to your hidden photos. And anytime you want to unhide a hidden photo, just open the photo, tap on the three dot button and then select unhide. And once again, you can do this for multiple hidden photos. So just tap on select in the top right corner and then select the photos you want to unhide and then tap on the three dot button and then select unhide. And those photos are going to be returned to exactly where they were in the photos app. So that is basically how to hide photos. Now, of course, if you want to hide all the photos in your photos app, you can, you might as well just go ahead and hide the entire photo library. Now that's not really practical because for different reasons, you might want to just hide some photos, but if you want to hide the entire photos app, then I have a different video, which I'll link down below. You can see how to hide apps on your iPhone 16 and iPhone 16 pro. Thanks for watching. If you found this video useful, don't forget to leave a like and maybe even subscribe. And if you have any comments or questions, feel free to leave them down in the comment section below. Once again, my name is Chris. I'll talk to you guys in the next one. Good luck.